Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel on Jelly. I'm your friend Jelly. How are you all doing? First of all, I am doing great. I hope you are doing great. Today's video, I'm going to try to do an eyeshadow tutorial, which I have saved and put on my Instagram in the saved section. I'm just going to check what's my vibe in my saved section, and I'm just going to choose one. Of them video and I'm gonna try that and that's what I'm planning to do for the next some of the videos where I want to try all those things which I always save but I don't try them that's what I'm gonna do and I'm also gonna take you with me in it and you can also try it at home I'm sure up you may say you know what's our you know beauty hacks they get up in a safe section with a cover a bit of trying it here as you know every makeup thing starts with the skincare which I've already done it as you can see a lot of thing is going on on my face uh, which is because of the weather because of the food and a lot of other factors are there also I'm changing too many skincare products because I'm trying out and I think my skin in the process of that got a little bit harmed because that's what happens if you break nahi de rahe ho and you keep on changing the product also before I jump onto the first concealer thing let me tell you it's max strobe cream hydrant luminex primer i got it in a very small thing i never tried it but i'm trying it now usually i don't put primer on my face but i am trying new things today so let's ruin my face totally so first of all i'm going to go with the concealer the concealer which i use is max studio finish concealer nc35 aa0 foundation with foundation i always try to put a less and i'm using max studio fix fluid spf 15 the number is a49 and c41 so i'm going to go with the sponge only this tiny one and i'm just going to go on my all over the face and just press it like some people tend to use the brush also right i am sure there must be some people who will say okay we don't like to use sponge but i have seen some changes by using sponge and not brush or maybe i'm not using a better brush suggest me <laughs> um but yeah like right now i'm using just a sponge and just pressing the foundation wherever i want wherever the coverage i want i think this is not full coverage because when i bought it like i told the lady ki meko full coverage nahi chahiye pata nahi kyun maine ye bola no i know why maine ye bola because not looking so much like you have put so much makeup or something maybe because of that but then now i realize it's just makeup makeup is meant for it so you should have just bought it now i'm going to just cover my face this video i'm sure i'm going to just make it fast forward because nobody wants to see how you put foundation but still like my some of my followers might want to see how i do it you know what i made a mistake i should have done first eyes i'm sorry sometimes i just forget that i'm talking not to the camera i'm talking to the mirror <laughs> we'll check what we're going to do today and then we're going to jump onto it so i have two palettes like i'm going to use the tami x palette revolution palette because it's so many beautiful colors oh i love this one this is really really hot let's try this one i think i have pink exactly not pink pink but we can try this one now i'm thinking of using two palettes because you know one brown color i need to pick up from my this huda beauty nude medium palette i will take it from this one and let's start our eyeshadow try to go from the wrong first of all i made a line like how i wanted to look and what is the shape i wanted to give it and one thing what i have learned is always you know if you want to make your filling your eyes or something like you want to feel inside light you should always look at your pupil where when you're looking in the middle you see where your pupil is ending and from there you should start it you'll be always on the safer side or aapko sahi lagega that's my tip <laughs> but like people have their own way of doing it so whatever the way you think it's comfortable you should go for it maybe i'll make it a little bit more darker here because 
hair should be a bit darker. Um, now we're gonna do the pink color on my middle. Okay, my pink is not so bright. Oh, it doesn't look so bad. <laughs> Do you have a favorite eye? Like which works, one works and the other one doesn't work? Because I have a favorite eye. I'm sure you will know which one. Because everybody has a favorite eye which always works very easily rather than the other one. The other one always makes drama. Today I'm just going with it whatever it is. But also it's all about like letting you guys also walk with me and see how I do it and just see my awkward face also. <laughs> I'm gonna use black eyeliner. I'm gonna put a little bit of eyeliner. I always use this eyeliner because I don't know, I am so used to all this eyeliner. It's, I don't know, from a very, very long time I'm using this eyeliner. And I've tried others also, waterproof, blah, blah, blah. But you know the heart connection? I like this eyeliner. And I think you're a pro if you know how to do it by this one. And color on my under eyelash. So it's all is together. The eyeshadow is done, as you can see. I like my makeup today for some reason because it just, I like the bold makeup. Like I was thinking it's gonna be more mellow, but I look like more tigress. I don't wanna wear lashes. I'm gonna go like this. Always curl first and then put mascara. And if you're wearing eyelashes, then you should wear first eyelashes and then go for it. And then I'm gonna do the same thing in my right eye. Now I'm gonna do a little bit contour because this uh, Katrina Cavs product, I have got it. I'm gonna go upward because when you're contouring, always go upward, not downward. Otherwise your face will just look downwards. What I don't like about this contour is it doesn't much like fast enough I would say I'm gonna do this trend which is going on about the lipstick thing and I'm gonna fill it up with the color bar lipstick which is pink pink I wanted to go with it because of my eye hair So this is the final look. So please like, share and subscribe and let me know in the comment section if you like this makeup. I'll see you guys next time.